You got wet hair. Now what? Welcome to the channel, guys. Welcome to the Hair Experience. I'm Curtis, your guide to get hair back on your head. <laughs> no, I'm just being stupid. Um, yeah, I was on my birthday vacation last week. Sorry if I was kind of slow to respond, but hey, Curtis has got to take a break every once in a while. Um, hair by MHE.com. Guys, starter kits, styling products, our white bond, our clear bond, um, shampoo, conditioner, leave-in conditioner, adhesive removers, all that stuff is there. Ebooks will get you the knowledge you need or my YouTube channel, but there's more stuff in the ebooks on a chronological order. Like so, just being stupid. Hair by MHE.com or myhairexperience.com. Check them out. What are you getting to today, Curtis? I'm, I, you're out of the shower. Now you need to towel dry your hair. This is going to be a stupid short one. I just want to get it out there because you're going to say, Curtis, wh why are you telling us this? Well, you guys who have been doing this a long time, you already know, you know exactly how to do this. But that new guy, he's gotten home and he's like, hmm, what the hell do I do now? No, says me, Curtis to the rescue. So I'm gonna grab my towel, stand by. All right, so some towels are thick. Some towels are thin. What I do, me personally, we have kind of the thicker towels. So what I do, and you're not gonna see me talk, but here we go. I'm in the shower. I'm getting out of the shower. I lay the towel on my head like so, okay? Like this. And then I kind of do this pat, like so, okay? Boom, 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 boom. All right, now I've patted dry. Now what I do next, okay? If I've got a thin towel, I can just leave the towel on my head and kind of do this to get my sides dry, okay? With these thicker towels, they kind of want to move everything around and you're not worried about your unit falling off. I'm not saying that. But what I'm trying to get at is control the, the, the towel a little bit. So I'll put my, hit, my thing here, my hand here, and then I'll kind of do this. I'll get my sides. I'm not sweating kind of where I'm going, you know what I'm saying? And then I do that. And then I take it off. I brush it out. Boom, 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 boom. And now I go to either one of two things. Um, I'm either going to blow dry it or let it air dry. So most of the time, you know, I, I'm here at home um, in the early mornings responding to email before I go into the office. So I'll just let it air dry. And then once it's air dry, then I can style it. If you need to, to blow dry, blow dry. Um, your time that you have out of the shower, depending on the bond you use, like some people use white bond and things like that that heat is gonna to wanna to cause that bond to be not 100%. It needs to cool down before you go directly into blow drying. So you might wanna put a cool hair dryer on your head and you're going to brush this way, okay? You're not gonna to wanna to pull, like you're not doing it like we had hair when we were kids, okay? You're really not going for that. Um, what you're going for is dry and then you can style or style while you're drying. If you use a clear bond, you really don't have a whole lot to worry about. Um, you can just blow dry and go. So that's what I got. Simple little thing. It's important that this kind of knowledge is out there because I, I didn't know when I got home the first time I had a hair system, what the hell do I do now? So that's what I got today, guys. Boom, hit it, it's free, it's free, no charge. Hit it down there and subscribe, you guys know. I'm looking out for you. I'm doing the absolute best I can. So uh, that's what I got. We'll see you in a couple of days, guys. Thanks.